Hello everybody, friends at uh, Lindisfarne Regional Training Partnership. This is uh, Paul Phillips, director of the seminary in Ratzeburg. Not the one you see, that's my colleague Jan Simonsen, who is uh, doing the German version of our little promotion CD of our seminary. I'm doing the English version now, and I'm speaking live, uh, so I might be looking for words uh, in between. What you see here is the map of our church, uh, the Church of North Germany, and right here we are already at the island of Ratzeburg, which is a, a little town in the north where you find our seminary. And uh, as you see here from above, it is a real island, uh, and at the end of the island there is this peninsula with the cathedral you see here, and this is where our seminary is located. A wonderful place for study and uh, living. Um, again, another picture here from the uh, cathedral that dates back to the 12th century. Um, here it is again at night. Uh, and we use the cathedral uh, as part of our uh, education for, for liturgy or other things. The cathedral dates back to... Uh, Henry the Lion, this is why you saw the lion, uh, and um, part of it is the former monastery uh, where you see bits of it here, uh, and within the monastery you will find the rooms where, uh, where our ordinance stay while they have courses in the seminar. Um, we move into the cathedral to give you an impression of what the cathedral is like. You see it's a Romanesque building um, uh, with not very much changes during the uh, last centuries. Um, now the pictures are faster than I'm talking. Uh, well <laughs> uh, this is uh, giving you an impression of other church-related organizations uh, in Ratzeburg, like the YMCA that you saw the building. Now here already the first German ordinance you see, uh, and it might give you the impression that German ordinance always uh, use the clergy and liturgical um, habit, or what the word is, clothes, uh, when they are in public, which is not the case. We just did it uh, for this little promotion uh, video. And to give you an idea of... Uh, uh, that this is a place where uh, where the uh, what we call vicars, you call it ordinance, where they spend uh, during their vicarship, which is two and a half years, they spend about 25 to 29 uh, weeks here in the seminar. Uh, some time of it they spend in the our library. Uh, our library contains 35,000 books and uh, our education is, of course, oriented on the person, on forming, but as well uh, on uh, education and um, learning how to preach and uh, modern approaches in homiletics and all that. Now, this is not a modern approach of homiletics, but gives you an idea of uh, life in the seminary. Um, Now the last pictures and this one gives you again an impression of what the buildings are like here, uh, like this courtyard within the uh, cathedral area, and all this uh, uh, will be a, will be the place where some of you um, in uh, May 2015, uh, when a group of you will come to Ratzeburg, um, you will uh, have the chance to get to see this all and experience the uh, atmosphere of this uh, place. Now coming back to our education, you see that uh, discussing, studying, uh, reading in the Bible, uh, um, worshipping, uh, that all is part of, of what's, been, uh, what's happening here in our seminar. Uh, Now the seminary is uh, not owning the house where we work in, but uh, 
the place is being run by a diaconical institution. You see some of the people here. A diaconical institution as a place for uh, menti- mental handicapped uh, people. So uh, there is a group uh, of those people living here, um, being taken care of of uh, some uh, uh, special educated people, and they all run the place here. They do the cooking, uh, they do the laundry, they do all the services that are necessary to run a guest house. Uh, and they run a little cafe that you see here, uh, which is uh, a brand new project of this uh, diaconical institution, uh, again being run by uh, people with uh, mental handicaps, uh, and it's a cafe open to the public. So uh, uh, when you come in May uh, 2015, there will be chances just to have a cup of coffee here, either inside or, as you saw before, outside, because in May uh, it might be a wonderful time already. So welcome uh, to Ratzeburg. We are happy to meet you and see you here uh, in 2015. Bye-bye and see you then.